Thank you. Thank you very much. The Rise Alliance project, as you know, has not come before council yet, and we will look for that feedback when it gets there. But I've got a lot of things I can comment on here. First of all, if the NPA were in power, you would get a, pro a pro project without art space and without rental space. And yet, in your plan that you spend a lot of time on, it gives a high priority to artist space and to rental space. It also identifies a couple of large sites that could be used for tall buildings, and this is one of them. In terms of no changes, it's already come down seven stories in the, in the pre-discussions. It hasn't come to us. So, um, yes, 26 to 19 stories. And I can point to many other examples where we have lowered things. Fraser and Broadway, we took three floors off of that building at the neighborhood's request, and we lost a lot of rental housing as a result. At Shannon Muse, the building was completely changed in its shape and its height and its massing. And uh, the buildings in Marple have changed due to, to uh, community input. Community input does help us make these decisions. But your own community plan identifies arts as a priority, it, it identifies rental as a priority, and condos do provide temporary rental. 